Hello, it's Brick Bros UK and we have official images from the LEGO Facebook page for four LEGO Batman movie sets that we'll be releasing in June for the second wave. Now there's also meant to be one more set in this second wave but sadly no images have released for this yet but hopefully one will soon. And we only have prices for these sets in dollars so I've estimated the pounds, euros and Australian dollar prices to give you an idea on cost. So starting with the smallest set it's Scarecrow Fearful Face Off 70913 which is the same price as Joker's Balloon Escape at £11.99p. Plus it also comes with a small power plant build that has an exploding play feature. But the best build as you can see is Scarecrow's Gyrocopter that has fear gas bombs and we like its design with the broom skis and the pumpkin emblem on the tail with rotors. So it should be a fun vehicle for the villain to change up play. Now this Scarecrow minifigure has its proper outfit unlike the pizza gear he had in the first wave of sets. And you might have noticed his hat and hair piece is the same piece from the Scarecrow in last year's Scarecrow Harvest of Fear. But it's great this cool villain is in a cheaper set plus we like his look. Whereas Batman is in his usual yellow and black suit and comes armed with a grapple gun. But oddly it doesn't look like he has his new yellow belt piece which is a shame so we're hoping this changes before the set releases because in all the other sets he has one. But on a positive note you do get the cool black Batwing piece that we haven't seen on a Lego Batman minifigure for a while. And it looks great combined with the jetpack that's firing flames out of the bottom. So overall Scarecrow Fearful Face Off is well worth getting for the cool Gyrocopter exclusive Scarecrow villain plus Batman gets a nice Batwing jetpack which seems great value. Next up it's Bane Toxic Truck Attack 70914 which is a set we can see being super popular because it's got the exclusive Big Fig Bane in it and it costs £54.99p. Now Big Fig Bane looks awesome with his Venom backpack and will be great to get for fans of the movie plus collectors. But along with Bane you get the exclusive mutant leader who pairs well with Bane and the usual black and yellow suit Batman that comes armed with a Batarang. And the builds include this cool toxic truck that's got 6 chunky wheels and a good orange colour scheme. Plus it's a bonus that the flags have Bane's childhood teddy on them. Then inside there's space for mutant leader in the cockpit and space for Bane on the back and the multi stud shooter has good detail with the sight on top. Then on the back there's a detachable toxic tank that can add to play so it's a pretty awesome villain vehicle. But as extras you get a toxic waste mini build with silo, free toxic bombs and an explode feature. And for Batman he gets this whirly bat that looks pretty poor but we guess they hit their piece count for the set but it's nice Batman gets a vehicle too. So overall Bane toxic truck attack is all about the villains especially Big Fig Bane and combined with his truck it's the perfect Bane set. Moving on it's Two-Face Double Demolition 70915 that costs £54.99p and it's a good set to get if you want Two-Face in his suit because he only came in an orange prison uniform in the Arkham set. And his half grey and black suit looks awesome with his head and hair piece but he also gets a Tommy gun weapon which is cool. Then the other minifigures are Batman in his usual yellow and black suit with Batarang weapons plus two Gotham City Police Department officers that have armour, weapons and one's got a police hat. Now the builds include Two Faces Excavator that has a good side bad side design, minifigure cabin, removable roof with weapon storage compartment plus it's also got four big wheels with deadly spikes on two and a working bucket at the front. Then on the side there's a multi stud shooter for firepower so it's got lots of features for play. You also get two road barriers and Batman gets the Bat Cycle which has a sticker on the side calling it the Bat Hawk. And this vehicle has two chunky wheels and opening cockpit with yellow windscreen plus Batwing doors. And it's well armed to match Two-Face's excavator with rotating double stud shooters with rotating flick missiles. And it's a welcome change to see Batman with a Bat Cycle in a movie set. And we love its red and black colour scheme but its style sort of reminds us of Nightwing. So overall the Two-Face double demolition is all about play and both vehicles will be fun to use but it's great to get Two-Face in his suit with some extra Gotham City police officers to add to your police force. And last up is the largest set the Batwing 70916 which costs £84.99p and it follows on nicely from the mini model poly bag that recently came out but we thought it was odd the set didn't release in wave 1 because the Batwing was featured a lot in the trailers. Now the minifigures include Batman with his yellow and black suit of course plus a Batarang and Robin just comes in his normal outfit. 
but you do get an exclusive Harley Quinn with 2-2 plus her hammer, and she gets a wheeled cannon with multi-stud shooter, maybe to take down the Batwing. Moving on though, the main attraction is the Batwing, that has a great design which is pretty much accurate to the vehicle we've seen in the trailer. It also has a dual minifigure cockpit, which is useful for Batman and Robin, that has a yellow windscreen. And other features include rotating boosters, adjustable wings for flight and landing modes, and for firepower you get two spring-loaded missiles and two disc shooters, which is epic. And a cool touch is this opening rear compartment, where this small car can be stored, so when Batman lands, he can drive off, if he's feeling lazy. So overall the minifigures in the Batman set are nice to get, especially the exclusive Harley Quinn, but really it's all about the awesome Batwing build that's packed full of features for play to let you recreate scenes from the movie, but design wise it would look good for the display or maybe parked in your Batcave. And that's all the images we have, so hopefully we might see an image for the fifth set soon. Now overall we've been impressed with all of these sets, but our favourite would be the Bane Toxic Truck Attack and the Batwing, but that's our choice, so please leave a comment below telling us what you think of these upcoming sets. Hope you enjoyed a Brick Bros UK LEGO News update, and don't forget to check our channel for the latest LEGO news, and like, comment, and subscribe to Brick Bros UK.